Ginger and pineapple. I think this is the perfect match. Pineapple is incredibly sweet while being on the lower end of the glycemic index. Ginger adds some zinc to the juice. I could add pineapple to all my juices, but then I'd be consuming too much fructose, so I restrict myself to once or, well, maybe twice per week. Hi, and welcome to bestjuicer.net and another weekly recipe that I'm sure will pump you up and bring more energy to your day. And best thing of all, your family will love it. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to receive your weekly dose of juicing recipes, tips and tricks to hack your body into shredding mode. Stay tuned until the end of the video because I'll reveal my trick to open a palm grenade without the mess. This recipe is delicious, especially when pomegranate is in season and it'll give your juice a nice color as well as you can see here. So what do we need for this recipe? First, we start with one half of a pineapple. You do need to remove the peel in order to juice it. I just cut along the sides, making sure I don't remove too much because all the nutrients sit right in there. Pineapple is a wonderful tropical fruit having exceptional juiciness, vibrant tropical flavor and immense health benefits. It contains a lot of calcium, potassium and vitamin C, so it'll protect your body against free radicals that attack and damage normal cells. What'll give this recipe a nice zing is a knob of ginger and I like to put it into my juicer just as is. You can play around with how much ginger you wanna add depending on how you like the taste of it. It tastes a little strong, but I mean, you can really play around and feel free to do whatever you like. Then we'll add the chopped celery into my beautiful Omega 8006 juicer. Make sure to chop it because the fiber in the celery might clog it a little bit. Then I add my magic ingredient, which, which pushes this juice to another level, pomegranate. Okay, I promised you a little trick, so to speak, to extract seeds from the pomegranate, and here it goes. First, fill a bowl with cold water. Use a sharp knife to cut the top of the pomegranate and cut into the sides like so. Place a pomegranate into the bowl upside down and start deseeding. You see, it won't create a mess and you can put it into strainer to remove the water. Then add it to your juice and voila! This is my pineapple gingerini. Sweet. The best part, you can strain the water even further and serve, as, serve it as a fresh pomegranate water with a little bit of lemon and ice. This is the perfect companion for a summer party and look at that color. And now for my favorite part of the movie, the tastes. Mmm. The pineapple has a really nice tropical flavor and you can really feel the sweetness of it. If you like to add a little more greens, you can really feel free to do that. Or if you like a little softer, you can add ice cubes to it. Well, I really hope you enjoyed this week's recipe. Make sure to Instagram tweet or send me your photo of this juice and I really love to see what you're coming up with. And of course, as always, subscribe to my channel for more awesome juice recipes, tips and tricks. <laughs> now the test. <laughs> my coworkers. Oh. <laughs> you like it? Excellent. Mm. Really good. <laughs> yeah, very, very sweet. Very nice. Nice milk flavor. Mm -hmm. This is the yep. moment we've all been waiting for, basically, the whole afternoon while shooting the videos. <laughs> <laughs>